Capital One is a financial services institution, and we like to think of ourselves as a more of a technology services, uh, technology company that provides financial services. When I first joined Capital One, I worked on a um, Unix administration team where we built AIX machines for the application team. So they would submit the request and they would sit there and wait. They needed a tool where they can rapidly deploy the application and configure it and not have to get on to the instances, the, the infrastructure, and manually configure anything themselves. They can provision their own stacks now immediately. The time is now really just the development time it takes to get the infrastructure as code developed and then get their application working on that infrastructure. So stack builds are now 20 to 30 minutes and they're not waiting for four to six weeks to get a server on which to run their application. And then waiting for another um, waiting for another server for a database. To maintain compliance, we're not allowed to be on an AMI that is older than two months. So every single, you know, every two months, we're having to redeploy our chef stacks, along with everybody at Capital One. They're having to redeploy all their application stacks to get on a more current AMI. So you cannot exist without having a, an automated way to handle that, because the overhead of you know, redeploying your, your, uh, your application manually all the time, there's no time for that. So Chef has helped us achieve that automation that we needed to be able to accomplish that. So we can do changes during the day and deploy them during the day and not have to wait for a change approval process to take place. So we, we build our pipelines to be, um, we, they're centered around a batch of software delivery principles. So things like um, static analysis, um, unit testing, functional testing, performance testing. So you build all those things into the pipelines to the point where Capital One is comfortable with you releasing your code and knowing that when it goes to production, it's going to be solid, it's going to work. And you've covered all your bases with what could go wrong with it as much as you can. And so the, the automation capabilities that Chef provides, the ability to keep configurations from drifting and ensure that you know every 30 minutes that their instances are checking back into Chef, the Chef server, and ensure that if there are any changes, they're gonna pull them down instantly. So helping manage the configuration across a wide breadth of um, you know, servers now is really the, the value that Chef provides for us.